Wave Hub is a pioneering project by the Southwest Regional Development Agency to create the world's largest test site for wave energy devices. JDR Cable Systems in Hartlepool has been commissioned to make the hub structure that will sit on the seabed off the coast of Southwest England and the 26 kilometer cable connecting it back to shore. The structure behind is the offshore connection block for, for WaveHub. It's the termination, the uh, electrical socket, which uh, connects to the end of the subsea cable, 25 kilometres out, located 50 metres down onto the seabed, uh, from which four 300 metre cable tails will go to the uh, wave energy converter devices. It's a very exciting stage. It's uh, seven years since the project was first mooted and uh, it's taken us a long while to get here. It is the world first, so you might expect it's taken a bit longer than something that you would buy off the shelf, but clearly not an off-the-shelf sh off structure uh, and something we're ex immensely proud of within the RDA. We're building a 25 kilometer power cable for WaveHub, and this means twisting together six 33 kilovolt capacity power cores along with two fiber optic cables. And then we will sheathe this 25 kilometer length with polyethylene and put two layers of high tensile steel armor over the top and then a final sheath. That'll then be connected with the WaveHub itself and four connecting cables will come from the wave up. This is brand new, we only opened it in July 2009 and it's been specifically developed for the growing offshore renewable energy market along with our traditional oil and gas umbilical market. It's very significant, it's the world's largest ever wave energy test centre and we're very proud to be in at the very start of this market which, with such a, uh, a major project for the UK. What happens next is that it gets connected onto the 25 kilometres of subsea cable, uh, terminations are made, full testing is undertaken, uh, the other 300 metres of cable are also joined on, end-to-end -end testing from, from uh, 25 kilometres to 300 metres at the other end of the structure, and then it gets loaded out onto an insulation vessel and taken down to hail. <laughs> 